Can we keep him? You want to keep the lizard? Wet shoes and walking on rocks isn't the best combination. It is so pretty out here, not even gonna lie, guys. Are we good or are we good? Okay. Hello and welcome back. Hey, how are you? How's it going? Man, I have not said that in a little while. Sorry. Today I have a little vlog for you guys. A little comeback vlog, I guess we'll say, because I've obviously been gone for a while. But before getting into that vlog, I'm gonna go ahead and basically talk to you guys and explain to you why I disappeared for, what, a month, I think? I don't really know exactly. I just know that I disappeared and um, it feels like I've been gone for a while. So I want to say about a month ago, I had kind of been feeling a little weird. Can't really point my finger exactly how I was feeling. I had hit a very confusing moment um, mentally and emotionally and almost every way possible. I wasn't feeling my worst, but I also wasn't feeling my best either. It was like a weird combination of the two. I couldn't really point it out. I was having so many energy slumps, but I was also still in a good mood. Like it, it was just really, really awkward for me. And the big reason why that started happening was because I had finished drinking my vitamins, my monthly supply of vitamins. For those of you who don't know, I do drink vitamins. I drink vitamins from the Cara Vitamins, not sponsored, just letting you guys know. I have been drinking these vitamins since the beginning of this year and every single time I was drinking them, I never really focused on how much it was affecting me. I didn't really think that they were doing anything. But once I finished my monthly supply in April, there was like a big pause that I have been taking because my monthly supply has been lagging due to COVID and all of that. So there's been a pause and I started noticing that it was affecting me. I was getting so many energy slumps. I wasn't feeling my best and I just became so much more lazy than I have probably ever been. So I sat back and I thought and I was like, whoa, stop drinking these vitamins and this is what started happening. Like, that's crazy because I didn't think they were doing anything. So that's basically the big reason why it all started. Um, the reason why I was going to take a break at first was to figure out how to get out of that confusing little mess that I was going through. But then, shortly after that was when things pretty much started going downhill for me and my family. I don't really want to mention what happened in my family just because I would like to keep that personal between us. But something did happen that basically just everything went downhill and then after that happened, everything started going wrong in the world. So you guys know what has been happening, if you watch the news or if you're on social media, it is all there, it's all over the place. And um, that affected me even more. <laughs> and I think it affected me so much just because one thing after another was happening, it was like layering on top of each other and it was just too much for me to handle mentally that at one point anxiety did come my way, thankfully. It was very easy going, but at the same time, since I don't really get anxiety attacks anymore, it did kind of hit me a little bit. But on the bright side, I was able to get through it and things are starting to feel a little bit better. I am starting to feel a little bit better. So I decided I would come back to YouTube and get this thing on a roll again. So currently, your girl is fine, I'm doing okay, taking it one day at a time. Um, my appetite isn't really all there, just because I did recently fight through anxiety, so after I do that, my appetite is funky. So, working on getting that appetite back. But onto some greater news, I am working once again. I have been back at work for like a couple of weeks now, and let me just say how freaking happy I am to be back at work. I missed it so much. I'm just so glad to be back. Like, whew, thank you. <laughs> and for those of you who don't know, 
when I am not doing YouTube, I am a cashier at a home furniture and decor store called At Home. It is the best thing. Been there for almost a year now and no complaints. <laughs> but yeah, guys, that is basically the little update for why I was gone for so long. I'm sorry for disappearing. I just, I really had to. Legit, it got to the point where I just had no motivation to film anymore. I was running low on video ideas and it just, it was just going downhill. So sorry, but we're back and I'm um, gonna carry on with today's video. So basically, I am going to be vlogging today because we are taking a little trip to Lytle Creek and, hello? <laughs> it's my um, reminder on care of to, almost dropped my phone, to drink my vitamins, but I don't have any vitamins to drink. So there's that. But anyways, we're taking a little trip and just going to spend the day at Lytle Creek because after all this stuff that has been going on in the world, we need it. So we're gonna go look at some different scenery, gather some fresh air and just have a good time. So I thought I'd go ahead and bring you guys along with me and um, yeah, let's get this day started guys. I actually woke up at like five, almost six in the morning today and after like an hour of being awake I thought to myself why not just do my makeup and get it out of the way while everyone is sleeping I'll be getting ready to myself so that's what I did and um, I feel good waking up that early I feel great probably just because I'm excited to go to Lido Creek though I don't know Moving on to today's outfit for our trip to Lytle Creek, I decided to go in with my black crop top that has a little lace edge, my Levi's, my flannel, and my Converse. We're gonna keep it casual and we're gonna keep it comfy, all right? Keep the lizard? Yeah. You can keep the lizard. Well, He's well. drinking the soda I dumped out. <laughs> she claims she doesn't like lizards, but she's over here. I don't. He's too busy drinking the soda. Look at him. Oh, 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 oh careful, 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 careful. Oh, careful. <laughs> hey, lizard. Come here, come here. No, oh, he went under. Just be careful. Oh, careful with the wasp. I'm scared. Why? Why are you scared? Because I'm cold. <laughs> oh, frick. <laughs> Aw, pepper. It's like a maze, right? Yes. Which way do you want to go? This way or that way? Okay. Careful with the puddles. The leader. Oh, look, look at butterfly. the butterfly. Look how big she is. Look at it. Oh, she's cute. All right, guys, we've made it to Lytle Creek. I am currently with Pops, and we're just exploring a little bit. Um, nobody else wanted to cross the river to the other side, so Pops and I were the brave ones to get it done. It is so pretty out here, not even gonna lie, guys. I really enjoy nature and exploring and since it's rare that I'm able to like go you outdoors and explore I try to enjoy the moment when I am out here yeah we saw a butterfly like pop said I just I love the outdoors I mean look how freaking cute it looks like we're in a freaking forest man this is cool it's okay just be careful oh no how are you gonna get to there I'll go over there that's fine oh the spider no spider there's no spider. Well, there's a spider web. There's a spider web, but come oh, on. No, there you go. Whoa. Oh, they're not blueberries. Huh? They're not blueberries. 
Oh, you thought those were blueberries? Guys, I legit had to take off my socks and just put my shoes back on to cross the river. So now I have soaking shoes on. That's great. Found a little pathway. I'm gonna see where it leads. You wanna go first or you want me to go first? Uh, I go first, I think. Okay, I'll hold your hand. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're a birdie sack? There is. Which way do we go? Um, we need to start it. Well, we're at a dead end. Here, let's see. Let's keep on going. Huh? <laughs> Looks like we could go through here. Yeah, we're not far, Pops. They're straight ahead. I think this is the stop, Pops. Or there's, there's a way over there. I don't know. We've legit just vanished from everybody <laughs> just to explore some more. We're lost! <laughs> I'm coming. Well, looks like there wasn't really much over here. So, um, we're gonna head back. Careful, Pops. You almost tripped. Here, let me, let me grab your hand so you don't fall. See, you guys, something that we didn't realize was that wet shoes and walking on rocks ah! isn't the best combination. Very slippery. Whoa, this place is like a trail. It's a trail? Like a map. Oh yeah, I get you. You wanna jump there? Jump. Oh. All right, getting back to civilization here at Lytle Creek. <laughs> I don't even know if that made sense. There it is. Oh, it looks like Pops is going another way. Are you okay? You're not done exploring yet? I don't know if you guys can see them. They're all the way over there on that side. Look how nice, guys. It just feels so good to be outside, period. Oh. Pipa oh. came to join. Oh, no, Pops just wants to keep exploring. Look, Pops. What? The leaves are blue. Why are they blue? Did someone paint them? Are you painting? Found a little path. Blair Witch Project. <laughs> Honestly, though, no, we're around people. It's still fine. I have so much trash in my shoes. It's not even funny. Me too. You too, pups. I just can't get over. I love trees. You guys have no idea. Like, do you know how pretty that is? Yeah, we saw some blue leaves. Pretty cool. Let's go this way. No, we can't go anywhere. We have to wait till Pipa comes back. We're lost again. We're not lost. We no, we're not. So we stumbled across some raspberries, or I think they're raspberries. I don't know. You guys correct me. It's pretty cute. Pretty cute. A little pine cone. Where? Right there. Oh, that's a teeny, teeny. Where's it at? It's right there. Look at the cute little pine cone. Alrighty guys, so we just got home from Lytle Creek. It was fun, but we did have to leave sooner than expected just because Biba had to go to work. So we had to make sure we came back in time, that way she can get ready and then head out. But it was fun though, really fun. Glad that I was able to do some exploring and enjoy the outdoors. <laughs> but with that guys, we are going to end the video right here. I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I also want to thank you guys for being patient with me as I go through these pretty interesting moments, confusing moments. It's very much appreciated. If you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and throw me a big ol' thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. Comment down below or go to my Instagram and DM me any video suggestions you guys may have for me. That would really help a girl out a bunch. Make sure those post notifications are turned on so you guys know exactly when I post my videos. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram because when I am not here, I am over there. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!